Hey aquarium fans, uh, I just picked up this top fin two gallon hexagon tank at a thrift store for five bucks. So it's got a couple scratches on it. I'm not usually a fan of plastic tanks. Probably not a lot of people are. Um, but my wife refuses to let us get rid of anything um, inhumanely by killing snails. And so I have what I call snail jars, which are just some plant scraps in pond and ranch horn snails that have um, propagated very quickly in my tank. Luckily now I have some turtles as well, and so I feed the snails to the turtles. Um, but I'm gonna try to put some snails and, at least for now, snails and plants in this little hexagon tank, and so I thought it was a pretty good deal. First thing, I'm curious if this these LED lights work on the hood here. Fingers crossed. Blue light, good sign. Ooh, it's changing, purple light. It's got a little remote here. White light. Red light. White. Changing. So LEDs work, that's exciting. All right, I already mentioned that this tank is plastic. I'm not a big fan of it. Um, I will say one nice thing about plastic is it's cheap. Um, that's about all I can say nice about it. But um, this tank is kind of cool. It has a little clip here on the top ledge where the little filter clips in. So when the lid is on, the light is in the lid and everything is kind of self-contained there, which is pretty cool. It's kind of a cool design. Um, the two and a half or two gallon size, I guess, is not really conducive to a lot. I, some people may put betas in something like this. I probably wouldn't, um, but because I'm just putting snails in it, it's just kind of a fun little project. Um, I think it's pretty cool. So I'm gonna fill it up and see, see how it looks, how it works. All right, and that is just about two gallons of water on there. And we'll see if this filter works. It's making noise. It's pretty loud. Hopefully that, there we go. Get some more water in it. And it looks like the filter is running. Okay, you guys, just a couple closing thoughts. Um, I didn't really put a lot of effort into this right now, but it's hard to see. There's three LED lights in the hood, and it doesn't seem like they're really lighting up the tank that much. This is compared to my Nikru LED on my 20 gallon long. This is just kind of leaves me wanting. The filter is pushing water through, so it seems like that should work okay, especially for something this small. Um, I was lucky to find it for five bucks at a thrift store, but I think it's like $26 new, and it's cool because it's all self-contained or whatever, but I would not get it for myself, knowing that the light is this weak, um, and if any elements were to fail, you're, I don't know that you can replace the lights on the hood that easily. Uh, the filter is pretty unique, so I don't know if they sell replacement parts, but overall, um, fun little project for $5. I don't think it's worth it for $25. Uh, but I hope you found that helpful, and I'll maybe update it if there's something exciting happening in the snail jar, snail tank in the future. I have some Brazilian pennywort, some creeping jenny, and frog bit in there for the snails to munch around on, so... Um, Maybe an update in the future.